Hi guys, it's Emily. Welcome back to my channel. I am here to share with you the January tag of the month by my friend Lori at Piles of Paragraphs. Here is her information, but I will also link to um, everything in the description box below. I am so super excited about this January kit. Um, it is so sparkly and who doesn't need some sparkle in 2021, right? Um, sparkle it helps everything. So I am so excited. Um, I have my Hickory Smoke Distress Ink already here. Um, and yeah, we're just going to get started. Look at this focal image. Isn't that just gorgeous? I love that. So yeah, we have a ton of pieces here. So let's just go for it, right? Okay, so here's our tag base. And we're just going to start... I'm going to go, well, I don't need to ink around it yet. All right, so I need to decide. First of all, I'm going to go ahead and cut out, uh, cut around the focal image here, this gorgeous shoe. This is, um, I think she said, it is from the New York Public Library Public Domain um, Images. use this color in a while so it is sort of um dusty <laughs> is it just me my craft room oh my gosh it is constantly just dusty I can't I can't keep it clean um yeah there, I guess it's all the paper fibers and fabric fibers and everything just sort of floating around the room all the time um you know it just is constantly messy and the dust level, I'm like, oh my gosh. All right, okay, so I went ahead and inked around that. Look at this adorable little star charm. Isn't that cute? And then there's a little um, bulb pin. And I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, let's see. Maybe I'll wait a second for that. And then we've got some really pretty like tissue paper with some silver foil and a piece of just shimmery silver paper. This is really thin tissue paper. This feels like, oh, it's cardstock, but I, was, I thought maybe it was wallpaper for a second, but that's really nice. This is like, um, like a charcoal gray vellum. That is fabulous. Uh, we've got just some like silvery sparkly papers, some textured paper. This is, I think this is um, sticky, glittery washi tape, just all kinds of awesomeness. Um, this is almost like, um, there's a word, I can't think of it. <laughs> this is really cool. I love this stuff. It's like um, a yarn netting kind of stretchy stuff. This I'll probably use at the top. It's like a sheer ribbon. This is really cool as well. So yeah, I, I don't have an idea at all. Um, I actually hadn't even opened the package before I started filming. So yeah, you're getting, you're getting uh, typical me, <laughs> no planning. All right, I think, I think, I don't know. Yeah, I'm, I don't know, we're just gonna go for it. Um, has I'm gonna cut this down well I can cut down that I can just overlap it that'll be fine too we're just gonna see what we get here I love tissue paper because you can sort of um, crumple it up like this and then it glues down really cool. So yeah, that is going to definitely be uh, something we do. And then, hmm, yeah, I don't know. I can't decide. There are so many cool pieces here. 
This I'm going to save for the top, I think, as well as this piece. Um, or maybe, maybe that instead, because this might be cool. I think I'm just going to do like sort of a stripey thing here. Let's see, is that long enough? Not quite, not quite. That'd be okay though, I think. And then, something like this, maybe? I'm, I'm, th I'm thinking as I go, so sorry. All right, yep. Okay, now I'm going to sew around this whole thing after I get all the bits sort of um, in place. So I'm going to glue. I'm trying to decide how I want to... Um, attach this vellum piece. I don't want it. I don't want the glue to show through. Do you know what I mean? I always struggle with, um, you know, sort of how to, how to do that. Um, let's use just a little bit of glue stick. And the focal image is probably going to go somewhere on top of this anyway. I just need it to kind of hold down enough to get it to the sewing machine. Is you know, that is what I'm attempting here. Just enough to get it to the sewing machine. And then this piece. to stretch. <laughs> I don't think it's going to. Let's, we could put this down first. there. 
So this will be the last, um, I'm filming ahead so that I can take a break um, between Christmas, well, between the day I'm filming, which is like five days before Christmas um, and New Year, the New Year. So this will be the last video you see before um, 2021. And then I have some really cool things planned. Let me trim this down. <clears throat> I am probably really off center. That's okay. I said in an earlier video last week. <laughs> well, you will see it. Well, it's so weird to talk in the future past tense. <laughs> anyway, uh, that, you know, off center is sort of a description of me. So, you know, I'm okay with off center. I am just sort of an off center person, right? It's okay. <laughs> All right, then I need to uh, sort of make my tag shape. I will do that in a second. I want to add this piece, I think. But I just want to add it <clears throat> to the tie here. Everything's so pretty, I don't want to cover all of it up. Sorry, I'm probably not still in the frame very well. <clears throat> okay. Okay, I just sort of stopped talking, didn't I? Sorry. I'm going to put this here, just sort of, um, take away from that really blunt edge a little bit. I think this is a sticker, like washi tape. Come on. Yeah. 
Oh goodness. All right, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it's not a sticker. I think it is. Come on. Maybe it's not. Let's try down here. <laughs> oh goodness. All right. <laughs> I really thought that this was um like washi tape but we might just put it on um, like it's, you know, um, I'm, I'm gonna sew it anyway, so it doesn't really matter, right? Just need to get it on here. And then we can only sew it down. It won't matter if there's a backing or not, right? All right. I keep getting out of frame, I'm sorry. I think. Yeah, okay, now. Let me cut the sort of tag shape here. Now, I'm, I'm thinking because I can't make a decision. <laughs> All right, I am going to take this to the sewing machine and I am going to um, do some sewing on it and then um, I will come back and we'll, we'll finish it up. All right, just a second, guys. Okay, my sewing machine didn't, didn't seem to love um, sewing on that, that foil, so it sort of skipped a little bit, um, but that's okay. So I have everything nice and secure now, and I can trim off um, all of my threads here. And what I would do is if I were gonna put this in a journal, um, I would just, you know, add a piece of um, like cardstock or something to the back here, or, um, I would just make it like a, a tuck spot for some other some other items. So I like how this is turning out so far. All right, let me see here. Um, I want to somehow use this piece underneath my little shoe image. Just not sure exactly where I want to put it yet and in which direction here. I think I am just going to staple this. Yep, I'm going to use my tiny attacher and staple this right on here. That. And then, yep, I'm going to put that on there just like that. Now I could have um, sewn around this, but you know, I didn't. So, <laughs> but yeah, I could have. Um, but I'm okay with not every, you know, 
everything doesn't have to be sewn and everything. We can have kind of a mixture of bits and pieces, right? I'm gonna put that right there. Like so, that's perfect. Fits there perfectly. Okay, while that's drying, um, all right, so I still have these pieces and then I have this really cool sticker here. I was thinking, let me see, I was thinking if I put this up here, sort of, um, you know, sort of centered, maybe if I can figure out the center. Um, yeah, like, like so. Then, yeah, okay, I got it. I think I have it. <laughs> I'm going to tie this, I think, maybe. We'll see how it goes. Just in the middle. If I don't like it, we'll undo it. No big deal. Yep, no, nope, don't like that. Okay. No big deal. Let's do something different. All right, I was gonna like pop an eyelet in here. Um, which I could still do, I think. I'm sort of wanting to cover up that staple now. So I'm just looking at, I'm just looking at the little bits and scraps that I have here and see if there's something I can make work to cover that up what if what if we cut out one of these little triangles Just sort of squishing it up. I'm just gonna take off the top of that. There we go. We can pop that right there. Let's use this glue. just I it's not necessary I just didn't like how that staple I usually you know most of the time I just leave the staples showing but I sort of like how that looks better so here's what we have so far and I think what I'll do is um yeah I am I'm gonna pop an eyelet there I'll just silver or I have black that'll work. I have silver ones, but I'm, I'm going to use slightly smaller. And so that's about an eighth of an inch. So let's. I didn't get that sticker on center. Do you see that? <laughs> So everything's going to be lopsided. Like I said, it's just, you know, who I am. It's okay. All right. Pop 
pop our little eyelet in there. We just pretend, you know, when it's so off center, you just pretend like you meant to do that. You know, I meant to do it that way. <laughs> okay, what's going on here? Hmm. Oh, just not, just not squeezing hard enough. <laughs> okay, I'm sure that I can feed this through. Maybe I say that. <laughs> Okay, so that is gonna tie up here, hopefully. My hands don't want to cooperate today. Now, I'm going to cut this so it's not so raggedy. Like that. So here is the finished January tag of the month by the lovely Lori at piles of paragraphs super sparkly super fun I loved this kit so much Lori um yeah so many fun bits and pieces in that all right guys I hope that that was fun um sorry I didn't get to use this piece but it's going to go into my my ribbon bowl or my lace bowl and it will get used for something else all right, guys, um, please go check out Lori's Etsy shop. And uh, she I think she still has um, Tag of the Month kits for previous months in there. And then you can also grab the January kit so you can make a sparkly tag. <laughs> All right, guys, have a fabulous day. Happy New Year. And um, I will be back soon with some brand new um, fun ideas uh, for the new year. All right, guys, take care. Stay safe and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.